Hey, hey guys, how's everybody out there doing? I wanted to do something a little bit different. So most people that know me know that I'm a big DIY person. So I thought it'd be kind of fun to do a natural DIY um, spray as well as a natural hand purifier. So it's super, super simple. And honestly, most of the ingredients I just had at home already, but they can also be found at your local health food store or online or I will put some links in the description below um, because a lot of this stuff is very cheap and easy to get at hand and you can make a large batch. So let's get right into it. I'm going to first start off with the hand purifier. So what you'll need, you'll need some aloe vera gel, you'll need water, um, vitamin E, uh, so I have little capsules here. I'm gonna just open those up. You can also just get like regular vitamin E in a bottle. Um, I'm going to use uh, Thieves Essential Oil. Uh, so again, we are going to use all of those properties and then just measuring spoons for that as well. So we'll start off with two tablespoons of aloe vera gel. I use my little, um, these things to make it easier just to kind of go in. Um, so we'll take the aloe vera gel and we'll just, like I said, two tablespoons in each little jar. And if you know, aloe vera gel comes out kind of thick, which is a good thing, right? So we want that all in there. So we want two tablespoons of that. Once we put the water, everything will kind of fall in as well. Do the thing. Super, super simple. Let all that goodness get in there. Then we're gonna want one tablespoon of water. Try not to make a mess. <laughs> And then that should push most of the aloe vera gel right through there. You see how it plop, plop, plop. <laughs> In this particular bottle, you can actually double it up as well. Um, and then we're going to take that uh, vitamin E. I just clip the tip and then squeeze the rest in there. Just be careful. Don't hurt yourself with this. Okay, guys? Please be gentle. So I'm actually going to do one more tablespoon in this one and then half a tablespoon of the water. And then we're going to do five drops of thieves in here, thieves essential oil. We got our thieves oil, just five drops of that. So that should be perfect. Hopefully it's not a little too much, but one, two, three, four, five. We are gonna wanna make sure this gets all throughout. Yep, fits perfectly. Actually, that is perfect. So I'll shake it up, just get all of that in there. And there you go, you have a nice natural DIY um, hand purifier, right? And so it just comes right out very nicely through the pump. You only need a little bit. Mmm, it smells heavenly. <laughs> Love that. All right, so now let's do the spray. So this is going to be super simple, super easy as well. You can go ahead and rinse this out. And that fits right in there as well. So you're going to need for this one, the Thieves Cleaner. You'll need some Witch Hazel. Um, be careful of the brand of Witch Hazel that you get. Um, I love and trust this brand. Um, so that's what I use. Then you'll need water. This time we're gonna use uh, Thieves Essential Oil as well as Lemon Essential Oil. So you'll need a uh, half a cap full of the Thieves Cleaner. You'll need just one teaspoon of witch hazel. And then you're gonna again do five drops of thieves and then we're gonna do five drops of lemon in this one. So actually let's do it not in the cone. So one, two, three, four, five. 
let's do lemon. One, two, three, four, five. There we go. And then the rest, you're gonna just fill it up with water. Makes you a nice little spray bottle. Shake that up, make sure the oils get all in there, and there you go. Now you have a nice uh, natural spray. This is great for surfaces, this is great for hands, cleaning off carts, um, but as you can see, um, you can make quite a few of them. Uh, so there you have it, simple, easy little solutions DIY with Dana. All right guys, have a good one, make it a great day.